What's going on everyone? Hope everyone's having a great day. I just finished work. Um, it's eight o'clock, 7.30. I went in at 7.30, so I worked 12 hours. Um, today, I made $825. Good day at work. Um, lately, I've been making a good amount of money at work, more so than usual. The goal is minimum of 300. Now, if I make 300, I'm mad. It's like not enough. So the goal is, we're gonna bump it up to 400 a day. Um, and yeah, we're gonna we're gonna make 400 bucks a day now instead of 300. So that's pretty cool. Today was a good day. I got 12 hours on the clock plus a hundred dollars a man as a tip. And uh, you know there was extra charges, and as you all know, I get a percent of the extra charges so I made 400 off the extra charges so the beginning of beginning of my day automatically I made 400 bucks and then the customer came up to me after and was like hey what's like what's a good tip for everyone and um like for how big the job was a good tip would be like 150 um 100 would be expected but I told him 100 bucks a man and he, he was like, oh, whoa, like, oh, I can't afford that, especially with the extra charges. And I was like, all right, well, you know, that's okay. You know, we're still gonna do an amazing job for you um, and take good care of your furniture. It's like, you, you can give us whatever you can afford. And he's like, yeah, I was thinking like 50, then I was like, yeah, that's absolutely fine. You know, still making him feel comfortable. And he came back like two minutes later and was like, you know what, screw it. Like, I'll just give you all a hundred bucks each. I was like, oh, all right, cool, thank you. You know, we're still gonna do a great job for you, so you got nothing to worry about. And, uh, you know, we did a great job. Um, completed the job. And, uh, yeah, end of the day, I made 825. And at work today, I spent, um, I bought a bacon, egg, and cheese, which was six bucks. And then later in the day, I got some uh, Wendy's, which I spent seven there. So six and seven, I spent 13 bucks today, and I made 825. So the profits for the day are $812 profit. So pretty good. Now, you know, how you guys can do that, you know, you need to get a job that pays well, that you're higher up in, so. I get paid more than all the other drivers because I've, I've been there a long time as well as I've been managed I was managing for a year straight by myself now there's two managers um, I still get paid a manager salary and I get paid more when I'm on the trucks so I got to that position by working hard and going above and beyond doing you know, I was only a driver when I decided to start doing manager work without even getting paid for it. I was just doing what a manager would do, you know, getting as many reviews as I could for the company, being the beat, beating the manager to work every morning, pulling out the trucks, making sure all the equipment was on them. So, you know, when it came time, because I knew that manager was leaving eventually, so I set myself up so I already knew his position and that everyone else like that would make the decision, including the previous manager, um, that I would be the best choice for it because I was already doing it. So um, that was a really cool point of my life when I was given the manager position because um, it was something I was consciously working towards and I ended up getting it. So now I'm a manager as well as the number one driver. I work seven days a week, so I make great money. And, you know, I'm working on other ventures as well. So it's not just work because, you know, you can, you're never really going to become rich just working for someone. You got to take that money and do something with it. So what I do is I, I invest a lot more than I save a lot and I invest a lot. I, I invest like 50% of what I make and I save the other 40%. Maybe I spend 10%, you know, like today spent 13 bucks you know this week um, I'm probably gonna spend in total like $200 between miscellaneous expenses you know I did rip my sweatpants so good pair of sweatpants so I kind of need a new one you know 
can't wear these out anymore. But, um, but yeah, you guys got to, whatever position you're in, you got to work up, make more money. Today was it, when I was in Wendy's, I saw on the, on like, you know, the back bulletin board that they had employees of the month. And it said that the employee of the month got a $250 bonus. So just by being, you know, putting yourself out there and being the employee of the month, you're going to make an extra $250 a month in Wendy's. It's not every Wendy's, but the one I was in today. So that's an extra almost $3,000 a year. I think it is $3,000. So those are ways that you get paid more, go above and beyond, and get better positions. Because I'm sure if you win employee in the month for a year straight, you're going to end up being the manager. And then... You're gonna get paid more for doing that. So always be working to move up. Whether it's in the job you have or in life, always educate yourself, read more, learn more, work on yourself, keep keep your body in great shape. Like today, I'm gonna go to the gym. I'm not gonna work out though. I'm gonna hit the sauna and stretch in the sauna and then go in the hot tub and relax. Cause I already lifted plenty of tons at work so I don't I don't have to work out I don't think it would be smart to lift more weights um, so I'm gonna go and let my body relax recover eat some food um, I'm gonna buy protein today have a protein shake because protein helps recover as well so I'm taking care of my body I'm taking care of my mind and I'm taking care of my life too, my bank account. I'm making sure everything's progressing. Everything's moving forward. So always keep moving forward. Always progress. You know, this, this this is what I've done. And every day, you know, I get better. I make more money. I get stronger. And, you know, the trajectory I'm, I'm on is a good one. Because I'm going to be able to retire. Even though I don't want to retire. I'm going to have the means to retire in a young age, which is the goal. I wanna be able to have have free time as much as I want, if I want it. I do love working. I also plan on taking on more work as well, because I do have downtime as well. And normally in my downtime, I am reading, studying, and or sleeping, or napping. And I'm replacing the napping with more reading and educating myself. Because I only nap when I get bored. I normally don't nap when I'm tired because I get a good seven hours every night and that's good for me I'm happy with that so that's all for today thank you for watching like leave a comment and subscribe to my YouTube YouTube channel I'm gonna make you know I've been making shorts as well um, some of them are random like my cat videos but I try to focus on like working out and I want to make more I'm gonna make more content on like I like making more money, mindset, stuff like that. Thank you for watching, everyone. Have a great night. Peace.